Omicron. So what up, what up, what up, what up, what up, YouTube, it's your boy G-R-E-J-E-S-M. Oh, yo, everything that I got on, I got from either Walmart or Target. And it's all, you know, within the fashion I like. Blue jeans, um, boots, hoodie, t-shirt. Actually, the t-shirt, t-shirt I actually wound up getting from uh, Loot Creek. But... I'm on my way to Whole Foods and I just forgot my water bottles. So let me run back inside and go grab those before my door automatically locks. I'm about to bust a Casey Neistat and go grab my uh, my uh, holder for the. So it's like a little mini, you know, uh, gorilla pod. It's just a little cell phone case holder, or a little cell phone holder with the, you know, the three prong. Now, I've been hearing a lot about Vlogmas, and uh, I'm supposed to vlog for 25 days straight. I want to see if I can do it for just this one day. Hey, good morning. Good morning. How are you doing today? Pretty good. All right. This uh, little stand, it is by Joby. I don't know if you can see that. But um, it's pretty cool. If uh, my phone had the little screw in the bottom, or phone, <laughs> if my camera had the little screw in the bottom, I would still use that, but it doesn't, so I really can't. I don't know if you guys can tell, but my car is a lot quieter. I got the muffler fix, and it feels great. Uh, so I'm gonna stop and go get some gas. Uh, those water bottles that you see back there are, um, so that I can go get some alkaline water from Whole Foods. Uh, it's like a dollar to fill up a gallon. So, you know, where you would normally buy water for like, what, 80 cents or a, a dollar. Um, you can actually go to Whole Foods and get alkaline, you know, healthy, healing, you know, life-promoting water. So, so you know what's annoying? When you pay somebody to do something, you think that it's all done, and it's not. So take, for example, my car. Now, the place where I get my car done, I want to say they do a good job because they always fix something. They just don't always fix the right thing. My muffler sounds great. Car runs nice and smooth. But, check engine light is on. Still haven't passed inspection. I think this car will last me long enough, you know, but I just gotta, you know, take care of it and uh, make sure that I stay on top of all the updates and stuff like that, but it just pisses me off. Like, I pay you to fix my car and everything's not fixed. As a matter of fact, when I drove off, the check engine light was off and then when I left their parking lot, it came right back on. Alright, so got something special uh, I didn't want to pick it out and show you guys I'll show you when I get home um, but I think I'm gonna like it Ugh. and uh, I'll let you guys know what I think about it when I get home <laughs> So, you know, as an adult, you need to have those friends that you can just talk to, you know, like, um, talk about anything, you know, the crazy stuff, the, the sane stuff, the, the personal stuff. You, you need people to talk to. I was just at, uh, my boy Steve's gym, and that's usually what I do. I'll go in there and I'll talk to him about, uh, you know, worldly events, uh, things going on, you know, uh, 
uh, with the U.S. and over abroad. Most of the stuff is, uh, you know, religious based. Um, but, you know, some of the stuff isn't. So what I usually do is go chit chat with him before I go to head out on the road. Uh, but today I have off, so you know, I'm good. Boom, baby! Beyond Beef Burgers! So, I got the Beyond Beef Burgers. Give it a try. See what it tastes like. Alright, so we are home. Sitting at the computer. I'm about to eat this uh, food that I made earlier. Let's see if uh, you guys can actually get a good peek at this. So, I took some quinoa and some TVP. And uh, I got some green lentils in there. Uh, along with the quinoa and the TVP, there's uh, some broccoli and onions, you know, mixed in. Um, so, this is, uh, I had this earlier. It's actually, you know, really good. But I'm also having this juice. It's a little separated right now. Um, but uh, there's celery, cucumbers. Um, one carrot, a little bit of honeydew melon. Uh, it's just a bunch of stuff I just threw in there and uh, juiced it all up. Uh, some ginger. Really, it's mostly celery and cucumber. But, you know, just trying to you know, kick back and relax. So, there they go. Cooking away. And it's crazy because like in the container exactly. it looks like it was bleeding but it, it's it's not a, a an animal so let's take a look at this real quick Beyond Burger uh, 20 grams of plant protein per serving no soy no gluten no GMO uh, cooking instructions it's perishable you can either make it on a uh, skillet or on the barbecue I mean the instructions are to cook it uh, <laughs> I don't I don't really know what else you would do, but let's look at the nutritional facts. The nutritional facts: 22 grams of fat. That's right. But zero grams of cholesterol. 450 grams of sodium. Total carbohydrates: six. Total grams of protein: 20. So, for those who like to count their macros, this would be keto friendly. And there are two servings. Little four ounce patties or quarter pounders. So I'll let you know what they uh, look like when they're all done. These like flatbread sandwich things because I didn't feel like getting a bun. And uh, my wife messed me up and <laughs> threw the burger at me. So now it's got ketchup on the outside of it. But so here we go. She's already, look, she's eating before me. Go. It actually tastes like burger-ish. You might taste like a chicken burger. Look at another bite. It tastes like a chicken burger. No. Chicken. Or turkey. That's what it reminds me of. It's pretty good. Um, doesn't taste like beef at all. But it's more like, like a poultry. Like a yeah, it's like just, a turkey burger. Okay, so it's like a turkey burger. Not bad. I like that it's like crispy outside. It's good though. Very good. Mm-hmm. I mean, I'm over here killing it. So it must be good. I'm just trying to think of how to describe it. Just like a turkey burger. Okay. So it tastes like a turkey burger. She said that like five times. And I still don't understand it. But it does taste good. 
But is it worth almost three dollars a patty? It's like six bucks for a pack of two. Um, it's cool and everything, but it might be a little bit uh, on the expensive side. So basically, that's my day. Um, I'm gonna take this footage, you know, try to mix it all up, uh, throw it together, and see if I get a video out to you guys, uh, you know, as soon as possible. But um, this is November the 30th, and it is my last day of eating uh, meat. So that's why I got the Beyond Beef Burger. Um, I'm sorry, Beyond Meat Burger, and uh, you know, I decided to go ahead and and uh, go full force you know into vegan uh, my wife and my daughter they're probably still going to do the whole dairy thing so they'll be you know vegetarian for the most part uh, but I'm going to do my best to go full vegan I, I just I like the way it feels I talked to a friend of mine on Facebook and uh, they said that you know yeah I could tell that you were going to go back you know because of you know how passionate you are about it and you know um, and you know they kind of know you know how I operate so yeah that's it. This is your boy, Jerry, JSMO, and I'm at.